I was at work, I was leaving work at night, and I leave with, a, um, with, with this guy, Rob, he's a chickaree fireman, and we just happened to walk out, and he said, I bet you somebody won with these numbers as birthdays, and I went, oh, yeah, I know, it's never going to be me, it's just a pipe dream I've always had, and he's reading these numbers, and I pull mine out, and I go, hey, I have that, I, I have that. I have that. And he goes, let me see that ticket. He goes, you just won. I go, you joke it. Come on, please. He says, sign that ticket now. <laughs> and I couldn't drive anywhere. I couldn't do anything. So he followed me, actually, to make sure I was safely home to, to go and like that. That's, that's how our ticket. That's time. how I found out from, from him. Did you get did you did you anything? Work? How did it feel? I'm sorry? That was a colleague from work? A colleague from work that I've known for a long time. Did you work? I worked that ticket, and were you just there to buy it specifically? Or something else? Well, I was just there to buy it for just luck. Just to just go in, just buy a scratch ticket, and just say, okay, maybe it's me, maybe it won't be me. You know, it's just a chance, a chance I had to take. Just a quick pick? Um, no, actually, I chose some numbers, and then I chose two quick picks. How did you choose the Which number? Were there any significant? Um, the, my numbers were kind of basically random, like maybe with our birthdays, maybe one from here, one from there. It just, I just whatever could work and then you know um, we there's a thing between me and my mom and my stepfather and um, I have a friend we all go out to dinner on a Friday night and we all play Kino and our number is four <laughs> so <laughs> I just happened to choose and it worked it worked my it's advantage luck. it's it just luck. really did can you tell us about how, you, how you were feeling now what happened with your feelings your emotions <laughs> when, you, when you realize that you're the big winner. Last night it was kind of like I was, I didn't realize I won. Today, as I'm driving here, I'm still like, oh, this, this isn't true. This can't be. And then now it's like, uh, I, I am a winner. And uh, <laughs> I'm scared, but I'll be okay. You know, it's, it's, I'm just coming down from all that. And I want to be just, just me and just be alone and just be able to be me and figure out what I want. To do. Have, have you thought about what you're gonna do with all that money? Maybe the first thing you're gonna do. The first thing I want to do is I just want to sit back and relax. And my I had a pipe dream, and my pipe dream has finally come true. I wanted to retire in 12, and it came early. What do you do for work? Um, I work currently at Mercy Medical Center, and um, I was there for 32 years, and I was a unit extender patient care type of thing. Are so you we're still there, or are you? I'm. I've called. I've been told them I will not be coming back. <laughs> <laughs>